Now I'd like to introduce you to this lovely lady with this great smile, Jocelyn John. Jocelyn is a sponsored refugee and currently a student at Simon Fraser. We're so proud to have you here tonight. She's deeply <laughs> involved in an education initiative in Southeast Africa. Now, am I saying this right? Zaleka? Yes. Zaleka Project. Jocelyn, again, let's look at those choices and how Zaleka helps people with choices in life. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Thanks so much for having me. I'm honored to be part of this dialogue tonight. And I'm really excited for the wonderful question about how education creates choices and opportunities. I have this goal up here because education means the world to me and it makes the world go around really. Um, it changes the world. Our education projects play an important role in creating life choices and opportunities and especially for individuals whose life chances could otherwise be impossible. A perfect example is a program I have benefited from called the Student Refugee Program. The Student Refugee Program is one of many life-changing programs by the World University Service of Canada. Basically, the program enables young women and men whose education has been uh, disrupted by war and other social calamities to um, come to Canada to live as permanent residents and continue their education. And that has been a wonderful opportunity for me and it's been a wonderful transition for me to come from a refugee camp where my, li my life was uh, totally sometimes uh, miserable with no opportunities to pursue my post-secondary education and my parents with no choices and means to invest in my education. So it's a wonderful opportunity for me and um, I would say that education means freedom for me to inspire others by knowledge and empower with opportunities. I have founded the Zaleka project and what we mainly do is to explore ways and means to support uh, my refugee community. Uh, of course, my family and friends are still in the refugee camp and while I enjoy this wonderful opportunity that education has given me, I'm challenged to think of my family and friends who are still back there. And so uh, part of what we do is also to bring those stories of momentum to the Canadian audience because in Zarekul refugee camp, refugees have no means to express themselves or to express their concerns. While everybody in refugee camp is very important and have um, potentials, but they're undermined and they can't explore uh, their life choices. So part of it is really to bring those stories here. And um, we believe that um, in order to make a difference in uh, these refugees' lives, it's very important to uh, provide these refugees with a space where they can regain my, their freedom just like I did and um, have independence to pursue life and uh, to pursue life choices and opportunities. So yeah, right now we have a campaign. We're raising $30,000 to sponsor my family of nine. And I hope that one day uh, they will join me to Canada and we continue to explore ways and means to expand our networks and uh, hopefully we can change the whole entire community. One person at a time, yes. like you. <laughs> We're lucky to have you again. Okay.